Good afternoon and welcome back to Buster Boom. Today we take on Southend and Sutton. With six games to go in the National League, we could seal our place in League Two, which is an amazing achievement in two short seasons to get all the way up into the, the Football League. Back where Darlington belong, I think. Since you were last week, nothing's happened. There's been no games. Not very much has gone on. There's been a few notifications. The list of players released came out. Where are we? Inbox. Um, and I have decided to scout them all. Where did it go? It's miles down. I thought it was. No, it must be. It must be somewhere else. But I've definitely scattered them all anyway. Uh, hopefully, we can pick a few. There we go. Second one on the list. I'm thick. So we're scouting all these players. There's a few good ones in here, like Lee Jonas, defender for Liverpool. Can play it right back as well. Look at the physicals. Decent physicals there. Plenty of potential. Already wanted by Birmingham. So you know he could be a good one. Only 17. It's whether we can get in and whether the one will come to us. Kay and Edwards. I mean, he's not great, is he? I mean, this is the best one's been released, so it's odd. So there's a few good ones and there's a few bad ones. I'm not going to sign this bloke because there's no way I'll be able to sell his name, say his name. Polish. I just get to call him Matthias. Could someone in the comments tell me how to pronounce that? That'd be great. But yeah, today's game, South End at home. A bit of a problem. Everybody's knackered. Pennington's going to play even though he needs a rest. Erkelani's going to play even though he needs a rest. I've had to drop Clough out entirely. He is absolutely ruined. We're going to play Eastley in the final, by the way. That came through. So we're avoiding playing... Who was it? The other team was at South End or somebody like that. Uh, but we're going to avoid that. But today's team... And we are going to play with knackered players because we're playing South End. We have to go with our full strength team. Charman, Hector Ingram, Burke, Stanley, White, Rodwell, Erkelani, Frank Leff, Feeney, Pennington, Firth. The only other change you'd really have in there was perhaps Stanley... Out for Clough. And who did I bring onto the bench? And Gesson's on the bench. Hagarth's on the bench. You know what? Where's he gone? Let's put Henry on the bench there. So, yeah, we'll get into this. Hopefully, if we win here, we're 13 points clear with five games to go. And then the next game, we could seal our title if we win. If we win. Just if we win. Yeah. We'll be, 12, we'll be 13 clear with 12 to play for. And so, so, it doesn't matter what Southend do. If we win both games, we're up. I hope I've done the maths right there. And what's even more annoying is I should be great at maths. But thinking on the fly, perhaps not. Anyway, let's get into the match here. Let's have a look at South End's lineup, see if we recognise any players. Um, Tyler Hamilton, I recognise him. Farquhar Harson, yeah, because he's got a daft name. Jay Lynch, the goalkeeper, not many others. Kenny Coker, yeah, that's about it. Uh, pick up where you left off. Here we go. The recent stand in South End. South End are in bad form at the moment. Uh, you know what, we'll just go what the assistant says. What he recommends there. I don't usually watch all this rubbish, do I? Let's get treated into the game. I wonder if we draw Southampton, we're 10 clear. We, even if we draw here, we'll still be 10 clear. We'll win next game. And we're up anyway. We don't need to win this. But, you know, it makes things a bit easier. Air quality, hoofs it away. Charman is in. That is a poor decision from the centre back there, and it's 1 0. Who is that? That is absolutely awful. Hobson with awful defend there. Just lets the ball go over his head. Charman isn't quick by any means, but that's his 26 goal of the season. I mean, it's just a hoof forward, and look at that. How'd you miss that header? Charman, calm, composed, bears down on goal. Keeper doesn't really come off his line. He, well, he does come off his line, but he doesn't come out to meet him. And Charman just sticks in the back of there. 1 0. Oh, we're going up. I know it doesn't look like we're not going to go up anyway, given the games we've got left, but until it's secured, I am never too sure. Stanley, Rodwell. Rodwell picks it back up again. White, Cameron, that's Charman, never mind. Burke, that's my eyesight going, I haven't got a player called Cameron. I'm not saying his name, but you know. It's straight through to Coker. Who is in? Can he finish? He can't. Straight to Firth. See, opposite of Charman there. Charman was composed. Coker just bottled it. So that's why we're so clear at Southend. They just had an awful run of form, apparently. Let's let's um, close down. Priestley Farquhar Harson. What kind of name is that? Where's he from? He's English. Poor, poor boy. It was given a name like that. If you're called Priestley Farquhar Harson, I apologise, but you know it's not the best name in the world. Uh, things are going well. You keep a little better. I have to stop and look at the subs here because everybody's absolutely knackered. Frank Lett, Feeney, Pennington, back to Feeney, White, 
Rodwell, white again. Charming. Look at this for football. Oh, never mind. As soon as we try and hoof it, it goes wrong. Should just carry on with the ball. Feeney heads it back to White. White out to Stanley. Stanley with a shot from range and it's miles wide. If nothing else happens in this game, I'll be happy enough. Frank Letts knackered. Pennington's knackered. Do I have anyone to play it right back? Not really. Hmm. Someone can play it left back. Let's see if we can just take the sting out of the game. Hernandez with a corner to the back post. It's off the bar. Hernandez ball back into the box again. And it's caught by Firth. Thank God for that. Again, like I said, we don't need to win this. Look at the amount of people in the ground. Charman is in again. He's took it down well. Can he finish? It's a good save. Oh, South End fans. South End is a fair bit away from Darlington. Burke into the box. It's headed clear. Burke picks it back up again. Another crossing. He does not quite. Gives it to White. And it's cleared away. Pennington. Big ball forward. Stanley's there. Can he finish this time? It's just wide. It's another corner. It seems to be all us. Even though we're exhausted. Ball to the back post. Nobody's there. It's headed away. I need to sort these corner tackles. I think I'm going to put it to the front post every time instead. Um, you know what? We're 65 in. After this highlight, we'll change it round. Hector Ingham's got the ball. Gives it to Charman. Charman. Back to Rodwell. To Stanley. Stanley down the wing. Can he get a good ball in? No, he has a shot. But it's a corner. Bizarrely, the goalkeeper took it over the line there. But White with the corner. Ball to the... To nowhere, really. This highlight's going to carry on. It's not. Never mind. Let's get some subs on. Um, who's the most knackered? Pennington. We'll swap him for Batch. We'll do that. Uh, Air Kalani for Longolo. Rodwell for Hagar. Make three subs here. See, we lose this now. It's your fault. Making me make subs. But fresh legs. 15 shots we've had. 56% possession. And another corner here. White into the box. And is that an own goal? Because it's another bizarre... We're getting bizarre own goals here. And it's Bowo Mamono. We'll call him Elvis. Elvis at the back post. Comes off his blue suede shoes there. And it's the back of net. It's 2-0. And this title looks wrapped up to me. A draw in the next game, and we got it. Hernandez with a corner. Ten clear by Haygarth. Ten minutes to go, we're tuning up. We can't lose it from here, can we? Pierrick into the box, and it's off the bar. Batch clears it. Good lad, Batch. You'd be called Bap over here. Longolo with a throw in. Burke heads it on to White. White to Haygarth. Haygarth. Out to Longolo. White. Longolo. White. Burke. Charman. White. Hector Ingram. Can he finish? And he can. It's 3-0. And what a finish that is. Boomed right into the top corner. No chance for the goalkeeper. Hector Ingram is just superb at this level. Absolutely superb. Burke to Charman. And look at the, look at the football. It's beautiful. White into Hector Ingram here. One touch. And look at that for a finish. You're not saving that. You put three goalkeepers in, they're not saving that. And this game's wrapped up. I'm happy with that. I This is going to be the harder game. Watch us lose to Sutton now. I thought his name was Cocaine then. It's Keohain. <laughs> Pierrick. And they pulled one back, but it doesn't really matter. Brandon, Pierrick, Amabamiang. With the goal back there. A terrible. Yeah, less said about that, the better. But, you know, it's a good goal. It's pulled back to him. He hits it. One touch. Bang. I think Fair should be catching that, to be honest. But, you know what? We're winning 3-1 in the 91st minute. I can't complain. Look at Ludwig. Frank Alette is absolutely destroyed. Well done, lads. Yeah, I'm pleased with that result. You beat the second in the league. Can they be overtaken? They can. Yeovil can overtake them, actually. 13 points clear. Look at that. Older shot won 7-0 at Hartlepool. This is all the shot we've beaten three times the last episode. Wow. Solihull Moors are talky. We're a talky. I thought they were doing fairly well. Obviously not. Um, and Eastley. Eastley, here we play. Where are they hiding? 12th. We play in the um, cup final. So, brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Send assistance here. Look at the amount of... Kalani and Pennington are knackered. When's this next game? I need to check this because... Four days time. You know what? They're all resting for four days. Because we seal the title with this. If my maths are correct. Um, there we go. All have a big rest. 
Just have a big look. So I'm going to click on now to Sutton game. And hopefully we'll clinch the title. And I'll see you in a second. Welcome back then for the Sutton game. We can seal it here. We can. I did check. We had a team meeting beforehand. I managed to piss off Jack Rodwell for some reason. I said, you've been great this season. Go out there and make the final step. And he said, you should be praising us for our achievements this season already. You know what? He seems a bit of a troublemaker, this Jack Rodwell, doesn't he? I wonder why I didn't think that before. Other than that, his stats are a bit weird. Because I know he, he had an awful time at Sunderland, but he's still a good player. And to think that he's only got a flair of four is a bit strange. But anyway, we're going to go with Charman, Hector Ingram, Burke. Clough comes back in for Connor Stanley. Uh, White, Rodwell, Erkelani, Frank Leff, Feeney, Pennington and Firth. They're not as knackered as they were. But you know what? For this last game, they can go do it. And they can have a week off because we don't have a game for another week after this. Sutton are 20th, so we, again, we should be beating Sutton. We just need a draw. Just get out there and do it, boys. Should we win this comfortably? Where are Sutton? See, the 21st, or 20th, the 21st place in the form standing. Three of the last five they've lost. Is there a thing there? Go out there and... You know what? We'll just say that. We should be winning fairly comfortably. We should be. Should be absolutely steamrolling Sutton. I didn't show you their team. I can do it now, can't I? Their team is... I can't show you now because there's a highlight already. Burke clears it away. Picked up by Charman. Charman, back to White. White, inside to Rodwell. Rodwell, poor ball out wide, but Clough makes something of it. Clough brings it forward. Inside to Hector Ingham. Can Hector Ingham finish? He can't, he can't. No, he can't. Two bites to Sherry. He still can't score. Um, let's have a look at their team. Let me. I need to change this, don't I? Uh, Sutton formation. Insole, Wright, Edwards, Hall, Beauty Man, Eastman, Kennedy, Dickinson, Donnelly, Merch, and House. Eastman, I think I do recognise. Yeah, Craig Eastman. Where did he where did he play for before he played for Sutton? Play, played for Sutton for years. So that's probably where I recognise him from. Um Edwards, maybe? Jack Edwards, yes. Um you know what? Forget it. We'll just we'll just watch the rest of the game. I should have been there before. Air Kalani to Charman. Back to Air Kalani. Ball into the box, headed clear by Kennedy, White, Rodwell, Charman, Burke, Hector Ingram. He tries to play it through, doesn't quite get there, but Rodwell's got it again. Feeney plays a big ball forward, cleared away again. Air Kalani, Rodwell, Air Kalani again, Frank Alette. We're holding on to the ball really well here. I'm going to say this, we'll give it away now and they'll score. Big hoof forward. White is, I don't know why White's that far forward, but he gets a ball into the box eventually and Hector Ingram heads it over. Sutton are a weird team. They've been in the playoffs a few times, you know, and near the top, and just haven't quite made the jump up. They would have to rip up the pitch, in the same way Harrogate did this season. Burke, Hall, come on, boys, get the ball off him. Do not be losing the title against Sutton. Firth, Tafini, Pennington. Not quite. Right. Is that how you spell that? Right, right. Doesn't matter, Pennington takes the ball off him. Clough, back to Pennington. Pennington, ball over the top. He's been doing that all year. Hector Ingram's in again. Can he finish this time? He can't. Their keeper's having an absolute blinder. I'm going to have to have a look at him. Burke, ball into the box, headed away. Frank Alep picks it up, and that's it. That's just done. Who's their goalkeeper? House. Is it Greg? It's Brad House. It's not It's not the house. He's on loan. He's, well, he went on loan from, to Horsham last season. I don't know. But anyway... He's conceded 68 goals this year. So, can't be that good. Just playing well today. Hall brings it away for Sutton. Right on the stroke of half-time. Do not concede now. Incel is in, and it's a good save by Firth. Yeah, I did call him an incel. Yes, I'm too old to know what one of those is. Right, come on, boys. Charman gets the ball. And giving away a free kick. And is that is that it? A bizarre highlight. We're not doing badly. Yeah, well, yeah, we keep working hard. We'll win this. Somebody was absolutely exhausted, I think. I need to come off. Um, it might be Frank Alette. But we'll see how he gets on this half. Pennington to Clough. Clough with the ball into the box. And Burke heads straight to House. You don't want to do that. Merch. Ball into the box. It's just wide from something. Come on, boys. Don't be giving it up now. Right. Ball into the box, and it's off the bar. They're really coming out now. Eastman picks it up. They're trying to stay up. We're trying to go up. 
how is South End doing? Let's hope. Hopefully, hopefully they're blowing it. The, the draw with Port Vale. Another corner into the box. It's oh, it's one nil to Sutton. Hmm. <clears throat> Frank Lacks Nackets will take him off, and Clough Nackets will bring on Stanley. I, I'm not impressed with this. Burke gets down the wing. Can he get a ball into the box? Nobody's fouled. Oh, the chance to equalise straight after the kickoff. <sighs> It'd be charming, wouldn't it? It'd be charming. Come on. You've been great for the last two seasons. Just put the ball away. Charming steps up and puts it away. And it's one all. Back on level terms after about 20 seconds of going behind. <sighs> Nerves have gone a bit. <laughs> well, let's get a winner. Let's just seal it with a win. So I don't have to come back again till the end of the season. Air Kalani to White. Back to Air Kalani. We're doing now... Back heels and all sorts. Hector Ingram's in. Can he finish? He can. Hector Ingram with the gold. 28th goal of the season. Only signed in December. What a guy this boy is. How no one picked him up, I'll never know. Are the free transfers broke this year? Because some great players. I mean, I nearly had Josh McKecker in at one point. Air Kalani to Rodwell. Into Hector Ingram. Look at this for a finish. Bottom corner. Charman Hector Ingram with the goals. I can't break up that partnership next year. I'm going to have to play only one up front next year, though. Because we need a bit more defensive. Um, Rodwell's knackered bring on Max Hagarth and that's our last sub and I'm just going to give him a week off if we go up <coughs> Burke's knackered but you know what 13 minutes to go we're not going to lose here Charman back to Ercolani Ercolani into the box it's offside I knew he was offside he was miles offside well come on I can stop shaking my leg now I can be stop being nervous I don't need to see it again he was miles off But it's, it's been all, I mean, 15 shots, 2.23 XG. We'd have been FM'd here if we'd have lost this. South end of 2-0 up. I, I do think we're still up, though. And there we have it. We've won the league. Darlington, second league title in a row, up to League 2. What an effort that is. Some, I tell you what, some excellent signings made this year. Who's picking it up? Is it Charman's the captain here? Charman lifts the trophy. Wait. They do that, don't they? Whoa! I won't do that ever again, I'm sorry. But there we have it. Darlington League, Valorama National League winners, Football League, here we come. Back where we belong. And they do a lap of honour, but you can't see because for some reason their, uh, their stand gets in the way because it's that small. But yeah, there we go. Happy enough, we've won the league. Can't believe it. First time of asking. This is usually the hardest league to get out of. Like this and the championship. But well done, boys. Really well done. I made up with that. Let's see what kind of budget we get for next year. South End, where are they? They did win 2 0, but it doesn't matter. With 96 points. Four games to go. 13 clear. Can't be caught. Yeovil in the playoffs. Board request meeting for club improvement. Yeah, let's do this. <clears throat> we like your opinion the club should turn professional yeah definitely because I've been asking for this for years yeah we're going professional we have to go professional to go into the league Um, this, yeah great. I don't know who this boy is I'm sure somebody will tell me who is Sean Gregan history he was the manager of Darlington at one point 2013-14 he was the manager of Darlington when X now Darlington yeah, anyway, he was manager of I remember as a footballer, you know, in the in the you know, late 90s, mid-2000s, but, yeah. Um, board ecstatic, of course they are. Not to count, he won it last year. White praises Robinson, of course he does. Fitness concerns, I don't care about that. You know what, because they've done that, we're just going to rest. They won't train at all this week. They'll have a nice rest. And I think you know when we're all going to come back, don't we? We could do a double this year. Rest. For five days, there you go. And when do we come back then? Let's have a look. You know what? We'll come back for the Yeovil game at home. And then the cup final here. Or do we just do the cup final? I'll either do both or the cup final. We'll round up all the end of season awards and stuff like that. Go through all the other leagues and show you um, who won what where. Uh, you know, Premier League, La Liga. You know, Leagues 1, 2, Championship. Champions League. I forgot to do the Champions League last year. 
But I am really made up. League Two, it's going to be a big ask to get out of League Two. Now, there is more promotion places up for grabs. There's four of them. But it's still a big ask. If you have enjoyed this, please like, subscribe. Thanks very much for watching. As of today, or recording, we are only 16 subscribers off 6,000. Which is unbelievable, considering we really only started this in March. But thanks very much for watching. And I'll see you all again tomorrow.